questions for the naturalization test. B, system of government, questions 13 through 47. Aaron speaking podcast, four. B, system of government. Name one branch or part of the government. Congress. What stops one branch of government from becoming too powerful? Checks and balances. Who is in charge of the executive branch? The president. Who makes federal laws? Congress. What are the two parts of the U.S. Congress? The Senate and the House of Representatives. How many U.S. Senators are there? 100. We elect a U.S. Senator for how many years? Six. Who is one of your state's U.S. Senators now? The House of Representatives has how many voting members? 435. We elect a U.S. representative for how many years? Two. Name your U.S. representative. Who does a U.S. Senator represent? All people of the state. Why do some states have more representatives than other states? The state's population. We elect a president for how many years? Four, in what month do we vote for president? November. What is the name of the president of the United States now? What is the name of the vice president of the United States now? If the president can no longer serve, who becomes president? The vice president. If both the president and the vice president can no longer serve, who becomes president? The speaker of the House of Representatives. Who is the Commander-in-Chief of the Military. The President. Who signs bills to become laws? The President. Who vetoes bills? The President. What does the President's Cabinet do? advises the president. What are two cabinet level positions? Secretary of Agriculture and Secretary of Commerce. What does the judicial branch do? Reviews laws. What is the highest court in the United States? 
the Supreme Court. How many justices are on the Supreme Court? Nine. Who is the Chief Justice of the Supreme Court now? John Roberts. Under our Constitution, some powers belong to the federal government. What is one power of the federal government? To print money. Under our Constitution, some powers belong to the states. What is one power of the states? Provide schooling and education. Who is the governor of your state now? What is the capital of your state? What are the two major political parties in the United States? Democratic and Republican. What is the political party of the president now? What is the name of the Speaker of the House of Representatives? I have showed the most amount of people passing, getting 26 on TOEFL speaking than anybody else has. And when I say show, I mean real people like you can see and hear, Michelle here, not just a post that may be real or not, but a person that you can see and hear, the speaking templates are wrong. Because to get 26 on speak, and when you see somebody who did get 26 on speaking or above, and they tell you they use the speaking template, they did not get 26 on TOEFL IPT speaking because of the speaking template, no. They got 26 on TOEFL IBT speaking in spite of the limiting nature of the speaking template. They got 26 on TOEFL IBT speaking because their speaking fluency was so good, is so good that it was able to overcome the limiting structure that is speaking templates. I never got 26 using AI website. Mm. Okay, but you did on the real test after meetings with me. Yeah, yeah. If you want to see more videos with people giving you their best advice on how they got their 26 on TOEFL IBT speaking. You can watch that YouTube playlist. It's connected to this video and you can find it by searching for TOEFL IBT speaking 26. You can also find it by going through speaking26.com. These are people who before were not getting 26 on TOEFL speaking and after did get 26 and pass their tests. I asked them, hey, can you give your best advice to people who are still taking the test? How did you go from not passing to passing? When I read about the TOEFL exam, I didn't really think much of it. I just thought, okay, you know, straightforward thing. It's an English exam. Um, how difficult can it be? The pharmacy board needs specifically 26 in speaking. I used to change the template. Maybe this is more advanced, so I will use this the next exam. And I tried to practice this for uh, for maybe a month or two uh, to be able to master it, you know, to, to say it without thinking. Every time I found myself getting maybe less score or the same score. It doesn't make any difference to just ch change the <laughs> templates and use different introductory words. It didn't uh, make any difference for me. Some of my friends advised me to, uh, to start taking uh, sessions with you. This helped me in passing my TOEFL exam. Erin helped me to pass and get 26. Erin, actually, any words will not be enough. Uh, but really, really, I'm very thankful. 
plain sex and speaking and I finally got it and I finally I finally um I am I'm so excited to get to the next step and my pharmacist license. Look at my accent, look at people who got 26. So just surround yourself with people who motivate you. Look, I passed. That bit that's missing is probably the most important bit to get you to 26. Yes. And, and, and that's the bit where Ira and I felt helped me um, realize where I was going wrong. And, and that, that bit where I was going wrong, I think it, it, it goes for everyone. Every, who, it doesn't matter whether you speak English uh, is your first language or not. That bit that was missing is something everyone really needs to understand in order to, in order to get that 26. Once you uh, are in the level that you need to become advanced, mm in order to get the 26, mm. you need to get rid of, of the templates. Templates. Template will hinder your, your ability to deliver that, that question because it's, it shows that you are reading something or you are not speaking, you are reading. I was using completely different template or different way. I started to apply your way. And once I started to practice your way, oh, it's easy for me. That was really good for me. It really helped me because the, this, in my mind, I could speak faster. And I was, because I was confident. It's challenging, but you know, the, after you pass it, the feeling of victory, it's worth it. As English is my first language, I thought the speaking templates would be enough to get me the 26 that I needed. Unfortunately, it wasn't, and I only scored a 23. Your lack of getting 26? is not due to your speaking ability. It has been due to your less than optimal strategy. Get rid of the training wheels. The templates. The templates were like, oh my God. Why did they create those templates? Aaron, you, you are a big helpful for, for students like us. We need, we need somebody to like, Stir revolution in our heart inside. Mm. Give life to our conversation. And this is, will never happen through other sites like they have exact traditional pattern. Pattern the template, first, second, for example. Don't say, for example, the second time, for instance. Really? And like, robot, I put myself without life. I don't have the a freedom to speak. You don't have to worry that much about how can I mention two reasons with two details or two examples. It's too much for me. You help students to increase their fluency. Instead of following that speaking template or any other speaking template, trust your fluency. For the students who are taking with you, trust this guy. He's amazing. He will shift or improve your level as soon as possible. Like this. Jump, jump my score from 23 to 26, like, like this. How many hours I took with you? Five. Look at this. Five hours in two weeks. I passed my test. I was surprised that I passed after five sessions together. I hope you, uh, you keep inspiring and helping more pharmacists and more other students to achieve their goal and become a professional here in the United States. If I had um, just, you know, found you earlier. For people who's really, they have concern and they need to do it very fast, go, go to the, like, the, the original, the source, the source of help. Go to Aaron, he's the guy, he was the guy for me, and hopefully he's the guy for you. And he'll set you straight. He'll tell you what you need to do to get that 26.